no, the women are supposed to do it at the top. For our stay in Kyoto, we booked a Ryokan, which is a traditional Japanese style inn. Ours was called Matsubaya Ryokan and is a 10 to 15 minute walk from Kyoto Station and less than 5 minutes from Higashi Honganji Temple. Oh, it's here! Yay, we made it! I'm super excited because we have booked a Japanese inn. You have to leave your shoes by the door in this little shoe cabinet. So let's check it out. Oh wow. This is so cool. So this is our Japanese style room. We're gonna have to be sleeping on these tatami mats. We've got this traditional Japanese seating on the floor. Um, little treats here. Oh, some nice little biscuits. So what happens is, when it's time for bed, we have to unfold these futons and make our own bed, trying to be a more authentic Japanese experience. So I think outside these sliding doors, we have a little balcony. Not too much of a view unfortunately but nice to have a little bit of outdoor space these nice oh very soft squishy pillows um, modern aircon unit which would be great for the summer because it gets really hot here Let's see what's in this wardrobe oh wow so there's this small little kitchenette hidden in this what I thought was a wardrobe got some cutlery a kettle a hot plate open this one little fridge got um, a few little mod cons hidden away here so tucked away in the corner of the room is um, a safe, a phone, and a little telly. And then there's a, another cupboard up here, all oh, with a, another set of bedding. Really decent size compared to other Japanese rooms. And then here I think we've got a traditional Japanese alcove. They've also given us some towels and some Japanese pyjamas with instructions on how to set up the bed as well as how to put on the pyjamas. Let's check out the bathroom. Ooh, get a pair of wet slippers. Not too small for a Japanese bathroom. Sink with hand wash, hair dryer, spare loo roll, toilet with a um, lead a function. Have a look at the shower. The shower is like its own self-contained unit, like a wet room. Get okay, soap and shampoo. Pretty big tub actually. It's time for bed, so we're going to try on our Japanese pajamas. <laughs> We've got the instructions here on how to put them on. So let's see if we can uh, get Donkey in a set of Japanese pajamas.
made our beds for the night. Donkey's already in his. Hi Donkey! Hello! <laughs> so, essentially sleeping on the floor on a futon. The Raikan offers both Japanese and Western breakfast in the restaurant and there's a vending machine at the entrance for soft drinks. Hope you enjoyed the tour of our traditional Japanese room and thanks for watching.